Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, today I'm gonna go in right, right in there. Garden of Earthly Delights. All right. It's my local comic book store. I've been here before. If you guys watch my videos, you know this. Uh, but yeah, I'm just looking for some cheap comic books for my art. So let's go in. Okay guys, I'm downstairs. I love downstairs. It's like no one here right now. But as you can see, there's like a ton of action figures, uh, old old issues, whatever back issues. I don't even know what the price is yet. This room is closed on Saturdays. Today's Monday. All right. Oh my God. <laughs> so cool. I haven't been down in a basement for maybe two years now. Everything looks a little different. But holy shit. Hmm. Bandai 2007. Not bad. Some stuff here. It's a good Mythic Legions <laughs> scale. So what I'm doing here today is looking for ones that are, for comic books that are like Universal Monsters or anything from like, just older, older stuff. So, I'll check in with you guys in a second, gonna dig in. Ooh, Home Improvement Hot Wheels. I have that one, but... <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. I already have that, though. Xena, Hercules... We're being watched. <laughs> okay, time to dig in. <laughs> Robotech. No. That looks awesome. Ah, uh, but these are. I'm not sure what these are. I think they're. <sighs> no idea. Two for five, maybe. But this is like the kind of art style I'm looking for here. Well, not this, but... What? <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, he fought some Nazis. But yeah, I'm digging this Robotech graphic novel. Some good looking art. Oh man. Some interesting stuff in here.
Okay guys, I am back in the car. Just gonna show you real quick what I got for my art supplies here. Uh, Thundercats, really love that cover right there. Got a bunch of uh, Dark Souls. A bip bip. Blood of Dracula right there. That is uh, number 11. This, I really like the cover of that. Nosferatu. Pit number one. Pit number one. Max number one. Pit number three. Pit number four. Max number three. And max number two. So yeah, I got I had to pick up the pits and max. Uh, the pit and max uh, are for my collection and to hold on for future uh, way in the future to sell later. Uh, those I'm pretty sure will rise in value. I don't know. Um, I already have a bunch of spawn number ones. Those go for like 20, 25 bucks right now at comic book stores. Um, but yeah, I like those. Those are the ones I grew up with. Max, Pit, and uh, Spawn, Angela, a bunch of other uh, image comic stuff. That was what I was into. So unfortunately, I couldn't find what I needed today, which is Universal Monsters uh, magazines or comics. I sat, I was in there for like a good good hour in that basement just sifting through stuff I, I had to sterilize my hands for like 20 minutes uh, just because there's so much uh, so much to go through like just you saw it the whole basement is just nothing but uh, short boxes and long boxes just crazy uh, but anyway amazing deal I think I got 15 for for ten dollars yeah so like the more you buy, the cheaper it gets. So you you know whatever increments, blah blah blah. So I was like, you know what, fifteen for ten bucks is a good deal for especially for all of these, especially the carded and you know board um, bag and boarded ones. You know, come on, great deal. So, but yeah, that's it. Uh, thank you guys for coming along with me to Garden of <laughs> Garden of Earthly Delights. Um, it, it's an awesome place. I gotta tell you, I, I always love coming here. Um, oh. But yeah, uh, what's his name? Chuck. Chuck is the owner here, and usually he likes to uh, talk a little bit more. I like to talk to him. Uh, he might have not recognized me because of the mask and everything. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, a little weird for me to be in there today. Um, it's just like a hot day. Everything's strange. There's like people coming in and out. Everyone's really quiet. Like compared to... The last time I was here, right, you know, when the pandemic thing was happening and nobody was freaking out, uh, everyone was, you know, like in good moods and everyone was joking, telling stories. He was telling stories for like a while. So, uh, yeah, that that was an awesome visit. Uh, this was a great visit as well, but like it's just it shows you like how things are these days. Like people are just a little more worn out, more bummed out. The heat's wearing everyone out like. Uh, they opened at 12 today, so they just opened literally an hour ago. I came here, like, right on the dot. So, oh my god. It's like every store. Actually, this morning when I was doing um, the Langoliers uh, DVD hunt, I, I go to uh, Dollar Trees and hunt for the Langoliers, those of you that don't know. Uh, but yeah, I still haven't found it. Um, uh, I'm probably going to give the Langoliers thing up and just buy one, uh, buy like a Blu-ray at some point. It was just fun to look for it. It was just a dollar, you know, so but uh, I went to a Dollar Tree uh, I went to two or three Dollar Trees this morning looking for this thing. The first one I went to The lady was so like they open at 8, but they only let uh, elderly folks in until 9 between 8 and 9 Understandable admirable awesome great idea uh, But like I walked off, you know, it's like 8 45 and I'm like can I just go in real quick, take a look if the DVD is there? I'm not going to disturb anyone. I'm not going to purchase anything. I'm not going to like steal a whole bunch of toilet paper from an old lady and punch her in the face. I swear I won't do any of that actually ever. <laughs> but, you know, I was like, can I just go check if the DVD is there? I'll go real quick, check if it's there. If it's there, I'll come out and wait. If it's not, I can freaking, you know, skedaddle, keep going and keep searching for this thing. She was really pissed off. She's like, no, you you can come back at nine. I'm like, all right, smarty ass. <laughs> you know, like, all right. But anyway, I'll let that go, whatever. What are you gonna do? Uh, she was doing her job, probably really sick and tired of customers asking her stupid questions and all that. But, uh, you know, she didn't do anything wrong. She was just doing her job. But it was just frustrating, you know. I'm like, dude, I, the reason why the elderly are coming in and allowed to buy stuff at nine is because 
they can get things like toilet paper, essentials, you know, they can get first dibs. I feel like she was a little too, uh, too anal there, you know, had a rough, rough night or something. Um, all right, guys, uh, that's it. Um, absolutely love, love, love this place. Uh, I'm going to come back soon and keep digging. Um, just really f not feeling it today. I'm really hot. Um, uh, I don't know, just not comfortable today. So uh, I got these books. I got a nice stack. I'm going to come back uh, probably in about a week or so and uh, dig in there some more. Um, but yeah, if any of you have access to any of these comics I'm looking for, remember I'm looking for like Universal Monsters, so I need The Mummy, Invisible Man, Frankenstein, Werewolf, uh, Vampire, Dracula Guy, uh, you know, all those typical Universal Monsters, I need the, the vintage stuff uh, from back in the day. If anyone has any of that for a good price, please contact me, send me a message, maybe I can buy that off of you. If you're generous or can share definitely just my PO box number is right in the channel description uh, or just send me a message on Facebook or Instagram we'll get in touch you can just send it to me donate it or I can buy some things from you so please if you watch this far that means you like my stuff and you like my art maybe <laughs> and you want to help out so definitely hit me up if you can help me out with those particular magazines or comic books universal not soldiers universal monsters <laughs> so uh, that's it. Uh, Garden of Earthly Delights open for business, everybody. They've been open for a while. Go in there, buy stuff if you're in my area. If not, uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I didn't film much because I was busy looking through boxes. And it's not comfortable doing it with one hand, you know? So, all right. Bye, everyone. Live long and prosper. Uh, be good to each other and collect whatever the hell you want to collect. Don't let anyone else judge you for it. I just hope you don't collect. Oh, my God. Don't collect weird that shit. Uh, anyway, alright, bye! Workout pause. Come on, let's back away. What is happening with my camera right now?